Welcome back fellow techies to our latest tutorial video. I am the Technician Project and today's tutorial will show you how to add automation in Adobe Audition. We're starting off our project today in Adobe Audition with a audio track in our multi-track project. Please see our previous video on how to add and create a multi-track project within Adobe Audition. So we want to add automation to this track. We want to turn it down, we want to turn it up. It's dead easy and dead simple to do. Automation can be used as volume or panning, for example. So what we're gonna to do today, we're gonna to do a bit of panning and a bit of volume editing. So we can edit the volume by using this little pot here. Uh, and we can edit the panning by using this little pot here. But we don't want to do that. We want to go to automation, which is just to click on this little arrow here next to the read symbol. And it shows volume here. And then we can select volume and that's our yellow line is our zero dB volume. And if we want to edit that, we can click and it create a node or audition calls it a keyframe. So we're just gonna create two to three to four keyframes. So we've got a fade in, a fade out, sorry and a fade back in. Let's move this a little bit closer. So let's play it through. Perfect. So we can automate throughout the whole piece by just clicking a node and dragging it down and dragging it up. So we can go louder, we can go quieter. Lovely, so that's an automation. So if we select show envelopes, that shows that volume is being edited. We want to show panning now. We click on panning and it still shows the yellow automation of the volume line is in the background of the panning. Now panning is set uh, one or two ways. So we're gonna make a node and we're gonna make another node and we're gonna bring that up. We're gonna create two more nodes and bring that down. So what's it gonna do is it gonna pan left to right. So from the start, it will pan left into the right here. And back into the right here. So it goes from right here to left here to right here. Uh, and we can do that with normal volume so everyone can hear. So that should be coming out to your left speaker now. And that should be coming out to your right speaker or headphone, depending on what you're listening to. So that is showing panning. We can also show mute. So you can see that the mute line is up. We're just gonna turn it down so the track is then muted. So if we just do this and draw two more nodes in, we can draw three nodes in and just do a quick mute in the middle. So that's And you can see the track's gone grey because it's muted out. So the track is on at the top and off at the bottom. So if you click envelope, you can see that we've enabled the volume, we've enabled the mute, and we've enabled the panning. We can also add EQ and play with effects. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more. And also ding dong that notification bell to get further updates. Thanks again. Goodbye.